Whether you know it as the Kentucky Waterfall, the Tennessee Top Hat, or the Hockey Haircut, the mullet is a prominent staple of pop culture that is still seen today. Rock Castle County High School held a special competition as part of their Rock the Halls event to celebrate the down-home hairstyle. Watch the following video to catch all the highlights of the unique contest. First Trust Bank can help make your money do more. Ask about their CDs with annual percentages ranging from 2.27 APY to 2.53 APY. First Trust Bank has the staff dedicated to better serve you. Member FDIC, Equal Housing Lender, and MLS number 688788. This is actually our first annual Rock the Halls event, and we were trying to think of something just to bring in some extra crowd, and um, the mullet competition uh, was an idea that we had really because of a lot of the students at our high school that are now wearing them. We actually have three barbers that are local that will be judging along with our um, administrator and they are going to be three categories hipster mullet which is kind of the 2019 version of the mullet uh, we have country boy mullet that's the mullet that really never went away and then classic mullet is our overall winner today fccla is the student organization that goes hand in hand with family and consumer sciences education and the uh, proceeds that uh, come from this event are going to allow these students to travel to state and national competition this year we spoke with some of the hopeful contestants to get their perspective on the mullet, as well as their regiment for maintaining their free-spirited hairdo. So tell us why you came out here today, Raleigh. Well, kind of want to show my mullet off, and everyone at my school said I should do it. So tell us how long this took to grow out, because it looks wonderful, and it looks like a lot of years of work, right? Yeah, it took about two and a half years to grow. Do you care to turn around and show us for the camera? Nice. So tell us your regimen. Do you condition it? Do you have to do anything like that? Uh, I just use head and shoulders and I let my sister and my girlfriend do everything else. I mean, have you been, I should say, training for a while? Have you been growing out your hair for a while? Uh, I've been growing it for about 10 months. And got a perm about three weeks ago. So, yeah. I just, my, I just figured I'd come up here and show off my mullet. Yes. But my win, so. Now, you said it's your senior year, so have you been working on this for a while? Uh, like nine months, I think. I'll probably keep it till I graduate. So. so, what's the regimen? I mean, do you shampoo it? Do you condition every day? I uh, just shampoo it. You just use shampoo and conditioner, and that's it. Each of the nine contestants would stand in front of a panel of judges who were charged with determining which mullet would win the top prize. In the end, it was Raleigh Grimsley who was awarded the top honor of classic mullet by the judges. Grimsley received a special plaque and an assortment of prizes. For more stories like this, be sure to visit WBONTV.com. I'm Gage Hill.